I always get excited when I do interviews like these because inevitably one of these kids is going to be world famous and have a gold medal and be in the Olympics and win the X Games. This is Chris Lasky. He's the program director, uh, snowboard director over at Ski and Snowboard Club Vale. And these are your students. Uh, these kids. These kids, talents. They're, they're amazing. So what we have here is we have uh, one of our full-time members, Ian Kalapis, uh, has been with us for about five years. And then we have two of our weekend program kids, Carter and Cooper. How are you boys, brothers? You get along all the time? No, no, no not really. So who's the best snowboarder between the two of you? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Years ago. I, well, I want to talk about them before we get to Ian. Ian, by the way, congratulations. Just got his driver's license. Good for him. These kids, though, they are a driving force in one of my favorite disciplines of snowboarding, and that's border cross. Tell us about that. Uh, so border cross is pretty much a, um, a format where you race against um, you know other teams, other athletes, and uh, fastest one down the hill wins. Uh, you got a bunch of obstacles, jumps, and uh, you know tight turns that you have to maneuver through. So it's uh, it's fast paced and there's a lot of you know action involved. I'm getting down to this man now. Th let me ask you, this is your thing. You like going out there and doing border cross? Uh, yes. You, well, you wear a lot of pads. No, no. <laughs> no, you just go really fast. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and how close do you guys get to each other when you're going down? Oh my gosh, it is a race to the, just the finish. Yeah. As you say, it's one thing to go off the jumps, but you're, like, you're flying off of them right next to each other. I, yeah, at uh, full speed actually, so it's a little scary when you're right next to someone. You're the kid that I got to worry about when I see the signs up there that say no straight lining. These kids are quick. Very fast. Uh, it's it's a fast-paced program. Um, we're down the hill pretty quick, and uh, we're looking for everyone to try to like keep up and, and keep their skills up. Ian, what's your specialty? Uh, half pipe. Uh, and well, how is it to train here? Um, it's good. It's it's nice that they have the U.S. Open here because that's like brings a lot of publicity to Vail and its parks which is really nice. And they're saying you've been here for five years, part of this program. I mean, what a great place to train. What have you seen as the changes in the sport? I mean, what are the tricks that you have to pull now to be competitive? Um, doubles and triples, it's definitely gone up a lot. Yeah, and, and it seems like the park that we have here too is perfect for it. They just completed the super pipe that's over there and we will have the session coming. Any of you guys going to the X Games just to check it out? I think I will over uh, on Sunday. Yeah. I'm going to go check it out. You've got your driver's license now. You can head on over there. What are the age groups of the kids that can participate in the program, and how do they learn more about this? I mean, my boys are 8 and 10, Chris, and this is the dream place for them to go to school because they learn along with this. Yeah, so pretty much we have a very unique uh, program that allows kids to really excel on snow. Um, you pretty much... Uh, you, you train your mornings Tuesday to Friday from 8 a.m. To, uh, to noon, and then you go to school until about 4.45. So it really gives the athletes a lot of time on snow, as well as full days, Saturdays, and Sundays as training. And as a parent, we will conclude it in just a moment with more about the skiing and riding, but the academic side of it, what are the standards? Uh, we have pretty strict standards. We expect you to have good grades. You know, there's, it's, it's a C and above. Otherwise, you're going to be on academic probation. You spend more time in the classroom, less time on snow. Yeah, that's a big incentive then to get yeah. good grades. I know if I was a kid going, I mean, you know, I try to get the, the grades out of them. For you guys, what's the biggest part of this? I mean, what do you love most about the program? Uh, I love the program because it they teach us new th tricks and new grabs. Yeah, new moves, going faster, learn how to go faster. Also, diet's key with these young adults, we'll call them now, you know, feeding them the right stuff. Absolutely. So we spend a lot of time, we have um, a world-class gym right right outside of our school called the Mintern Fitness Center. Uh, every athlete trains in there quite a bit on the full-time program. The younger athletes aren't as concerned with, you know, lifting and getting, getting stronger as well as just trying to keep them on snow and getting their board skills stronger. So that's more the focus with our weekend program. All right, we have to wrap it up right now, but uh, if people want to learn more about the program, who do they contact? Uh, you're going to contact Contact me, uh, Chris Lasky, C. Lasky at SkiClubVail.org. Email me anytime. We'd love to see you come out and uh, do a ride day with the team and uh, just check out the program and uh, see how you like it. And you guys, I'm telling you, five, six years from now, remember me because I'm going to want to get that interview backstage at the X Games. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to happen. Where are you guys going riding today? Um, here at Vail. All right, perfect. Great to see you guys once again. Ian, Carter, Cooper, Chris, all with Ski and Snowboard Club Vail. This is the Snowboard Club Vail side of it. Learn more about it and check them out. Honest to goodness, you will see them in the X Games and beyond in the Olympics. More when we return from Good Morning Vail. We'll have your weather and mountain reports next.